There we go, fish tankers. This is one of the females out of the White Crane Super G experiment. It was on White Crane for 30 days. I put it back into the breeding tank and it was coloured up. It looked like a male. It's taken around 40 days back in the breeding tank before it's bred again. So fingers crossed that they're fertile, but I'm not sure what effect on white crane after 30 days would do anyway. Like it's not a long time really, so There we go. I was just telling Brendan from Rumble's Fish Room yesterday that they hadn't bred since they've been on the white crane, but here we go. You can see it in action fish tankers. It's just funny that a grey peacock can change its whole appearance to look like a male and coloured like a male with fin shape like a male. You throw back into a breeding tank and go back looking like a female and breeding like a female. So there we go, just thought I'd give you that little update. Stay tuned. Okay, so I've just stripped the female. It's about seven days later. There's the male there. Sorry, but it's late and the lights are off already. But let's go over to the egg tumbler tank and see if they're fertile. So there we go fish tankers, 25 to 30 days on white crane, coloured up fully like a male, thrown back into the breeding tank and probably should have worked out how many days but I think it's 40 to 50 days before she bred again. As you can see we've got heads and tails there. So, 25 days on Mike Crane, the fish can still breed and produce fry. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. fish can still breed and produce fry. And remember, if you want more tanks, get more tanks.